Well, our first morning in camp, it's about 7 a.m., clear. The air mattress didn't quite cut it. I didn't get much sleep last night, but it's about time to get up and make some breakfast anyway. Okay, so we made a couple of tune-ups to our uh, camping kit today. The first change we made was to our queen-size cot in here. The blow-up air mattress was just too bouncy-bouncy and kept us awake every time one of us turned. And it seemed to be losing air right out of the box. So we went into By Mart in Cottage Grove where we found this mattress topper, queen size mattress topper. So we took out the, um, the uh, inflatable mattress and put the mattress topper inside. And it's pretty dang comfortable. And it's much more firm, it doesn't bounce. So we'll see how that goes tonight. The porta potty did prove to be valuable, especially going at night after you were in bed, since we didn't want to track down to the public bathroom here. Besides, it's a public bathroom, so it's really kind of yucky anyway. And while we were at Bymart, we came upon this table for $89. Might think it's a little bit of an overkill, but actually it isn't. I'm trying to clean up and so forth after dinner, after the campfire when it's dark, having this thing organized is going to be really great. Not to mention that there's a light pole there. Cool, huh? Another thing I got while we were at By Mart was a toaster for my Coleman stove. Don't laugh, I've seen these things all my life and I always wonder if they work. Well, tomorrow morning I'm gonna find out. Our shower tent here is gonna need a lot of work. The sprayer sort of works, but doesn't have a lot of water pressure and the hose is pretty short. We really need something to sit on in here, maybe with a shelf or two to put things on. Uh, this tent has a couple of places where you're supposed to store your stuff, but the tent is very flimsy. It gets pulled down easily, so that's not really a good workable situation. So we're gonna have to think about this thing for a little bit. And look what Rose made for us. For so a nice sweet. hot day, ain't nothing like good cold watermelon. It's very sweet. Well, it's about 96 degrees now and we're sweltering from the heat. So we're just going to sit and relax in the shade. We won't get any fishing in today, but that's okay. We've got plenty of time. <laughs> 